the Dale E. Haidloff Community Arts Innovation Awards. Steve Harrison for Franklin the People's Park at Franklin Park Conservatory and Botanical Gardens. A Columbus native and a longtime resident of the Near East Side, Steve Harrison has been photographing life in Franklin Park for decades. These moments, ranging from everyday occurrences to slices of history, are preserved as large format black and white images on display June 24th through November 19th, 2023 at the Franklin Park Conservatory and Botanical Gardens. This exhibition is Harrison's first ever, but he was the photographer for the state of Ohio for 35 years, working with six Ohio governors. This uplifting showcase of primarily his personal work shines a spotlight on the park's rich history for the people of Columbus, a history that can be enjoyed by residents and visitors alike. Every once in a while, I'll go over and look at a sign book, and you see scribbling from little kids to good pictures, to, you know, that, and they'll draw little pictures in there themselves, you know, and to see the international travelers that have come through from India, from Japan, from, you know, all over, and to see their comments of how the images affected and how, you know, pleased they were with the work. Steve and I have lived in the same neighborhood for about 40 years. And uh, it wasn't until about 10 years ago that we actually started doing projects together. We started off with was doing panel discussions, um, Ohio history, historical society type of things. And, um, and we sort of liked the way we worked together. When he asked me back in the summer, uh, beginning of the summer, what, what would I like would I like to be in this project? I, I agreed to do it. I did most of the, the 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 shots that you saw in the exhibit, and I did a lot of arrangement of negatives and some croppings and uh, all the rest of it. And I never expected it to turn out as well as it did, but it really had had meaning to it. Harrison began photographing the park in the 60s and 70s when it was a popular spot for young black teens and their families. He continued to capture many historical moments there, including Ameriflora and Dick Gregory's food run, as well as daily life in the park up through recent years. The exhibition is complemented by recorded music from Columbus jazz musicians, an art form near and dear to Harrison's heart. It was low-hanging fruit just to go out into the park, take pictures of people, their cars, uh, what was going on, you know, uh, every weekend there was something. It used to be uh, Fourth of July fireworks. Always so much good activity going on in the park. It was a, a safe place, still is. And, and it's uh, something that I think it's a historic piece because if pre or more floor, you can see what the park looked like and, and you could feel the vibe there. Franklin the People's Park captures Franklin Park's importance as a gathering place for the black community of Columbus inviting community members to reminisce and reflect on the significant role the park and green spaces can have in bringing people together.